extra. Please input the gray painting's name. Okay. Uh, I don't know what the gray painting's name is. Okay. Wrong password. Begin. Before playing, please be aware that this game contains potentially disturbing content. For more details, please refer to README text for vague content warnings or content warning contains spoilers.txt for specific. Uh, show controls. Uh, movement, confirmation, cancel, open menu, escape or X. Video settings, F5, toggle full screen. Show introduction. The next game's gonna be a lot better, but it's just a demo, so it's gonna be disgustingly short, unfortunately. Once upon a time, there was a young woman pregnant with her first child, always. She was very nurturing and made sure to take good care of both herself and the unborn. One day, she was strolling through the forest. She had gotten lost and became a rather hungry. Worried about her baby, the woman tried to find something to eat. Soon, she found a cottage in the woods with a modest garden next to it. There, several trees and shrubs bore delicious fruits. The woman let out a sigh of relief and walked up to the garden. There, she picked several fruits and started to eat. However, the owner of the garden was not happy with the young woman's indulgence. You see, the garden was grown with utmost care by the witch who lived in the cottage. She had witnessed everything through the window. Just when the expecting mother was about to eat a third fruit, the witch approached her with a cold expression. How dare you eat from my garden? She snarled. Terrified, the trespasser vehemently apologized. I'm sorry, I'm so sorry. But it was too late. To make up for your grave mistake, I require a tribute. The expecting mother bowed her head. I I don't have anything of value, I'm afraid. The witch pondered for a minute, then replied. Your baby, that will suffice. Wait, her baby? Yes. This witch was a selfish and cruel. She acted in a way that can't be forgiven. But what happened to the baby? Well, maybe I'll tell you about that some other time. Okay. Don't look so sour. It's your birthday. I guess. Oh, before I forget. Happy birthday, Lavender. Oh, it's so pretty. Thank you so much. I'll be sure to take good care of it. I'm glad you like it. Oh, look at the time. I'm sorry, Lavender, but I have to go now. It's okay. I had fun. All right. I'll see myself out then. Through the trap door. I'll come by for lunch around two. Until then. Later, Mum. Woo! It's such a nice day. Oh, that's that's totally normal. And my present? It would be a shame if I didn't use it. But you'll wear it out. Ah. Oh, don't tell me she dropped it. Oh, don't tell me she dropped it out the window. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I... I dropped it. Mom will kill me. I... I have to get it back. There's a long 
And there's a long hair on the table. Obtain pink hair. I'm not sleepy. I'd love to paint something, but now is not the time. No time to read right now. My room doesn't need to be clean. Mom didn't lock the door. She usually does. I... Maybe I shouldn't. Well, here goes nothing. Can I just jump out the window? One, three, two. One, three, two. Done it. Oh God, I'm gonna have to play chess. There's a book about chess. The pawn. This chess piece is the smallest type of piece in any chess set. The top part of the piece is a large sphere symbolizing a human head. There are several things that set the pawn apart from other chess pieces. Firstly, a pawn can only move one tile forward per move towards the other side of the board. Secondly, it can only slay an opponent if it's diagonally forward from the occurrent occupied tile. Oh crap, the thing was moving and I didn't even see it. Lastly, when a pawn reaches the other side of the board, it can be sacrificed and replaced by any type of piece of the same color. That's not, a, that's not another pawn or a king. There's a book about chess. The King. This chess piece is the largest type of any piece in any chess set. The top part of the dot of the piece is usually modeled like a crown with a cross on top. The king can move horizontally, vertically, and diagonally. But may only go to tiles adjacent to the currently occupied tile per move. There's a long hair tucked between the pages. Obtained pink hair. God, my mother is collecting my hair. It's a book about chess, the basics of chess. The game of chess simulates a battlefield scenario where a battle takes place between two armies. Capturing pieces of the opposing color is done by moving to their current location. To distinguish the armies, each has its own associated color. Usually, the two colors used are black and white. To win the game, a player must either capture the king piece of the opposite army or put the king in a position where it can't move or stay in place without being in danger. The latter scenario is called checkmate. The king is in direct danger but can still get out of trouble. The scenario is referred to as a check instead. Bastion, it's a painting of a tower. There's a book about chess, chess puzzles. Using the movement rules and general game flow of a game of chess, various puzzles have been designed both as a way to hone one's skill and to pass time. Unlike a game of chess, however, they usually do not require a second player. A common puzzle is putting down certain pieces to cause a checkmate, which is more like a traditional game of chess. Other puzzles require the player to put down certain pieces in a way that would make it impossible for any piece to directly capture another. God, now I need to play chess. Am I black or am I white? The chess piece is nailed to the board and won't budge. The chess piece is nailed to the board and it won't budge. Oh God. Wait, this is a king, 
And this is a pawn. What, what are these two? I don't know what they are. I've never played chess. They told me this guy can move like this. And this guy can only move up and down and take pieces that are diagonally. What is it? What is this? I don't know what this is. So can I do like that? I won! I'm smart. I'm a god. Plea. It's a painting of two women, one begging the other. Okay, so I need to balance the board between these animals. Oh, bonnet. And so this should be way heavier. But you add a squirrel to it. And it's the exact same thing. But you, then you add a fox. And then you add a wolf. Fudge. That didn't work. Yeah, see that that's balanced, but oh, it's so hard to move. Wow. See, but you need to place all of the animals down. I've done it! The book on the table reads, when harmony is broken and its interests collide, the slightest imbalance will tip the scale. No pink hair, really? Temptation. It's a painting of an idyllic garden. That was by far the easiest one. The book on the table reads, A greedy hand moves forward, a target marked for grabs. A rope brings back the cornered, and the watchful eye observes. Commitment. It's a painting of a wedding. Is this checkers? What is this? That goes there. That goes there, 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 uh, there. What do you mean it doesn't fit? Oh no, it doesn't. Um, See, this won't fit here at all. Can I move these? Um, does this go here?
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two, four, six, seven. And this goes here. The book on the table reads, a bond for, did it say a bond for forever? Sealed with golden rings, these hearts join together, their fingers now bound. Oh, do it again. A bound, a bond for forever. There's a book about poaching ingredients. Okay, earwig, a tiny insect, eye, a human eye, durian, a strong smelling fruit, beard, tongue, a tube shaped flower, bear claw, a bear's most useful tool, chicken egg, a common food ingredient. There are several common ingredients listed on the page. Uh, no, go back. There are various items scattered on top of the table. There is a long hair among the potion ingredients. Future. It's a painting of a pregnant woman. Uh, an embryo is forming. A flower blooms inside. Two insects crawling over. The fruit of life that grows. Now these eyes will open. Each limb grows one sharp blood clot. Late. When these all mix together, they're finally. Uh, let me write this down. Uh, embryo forming. Flower. Blooms, two insects, fruit, eyes, each limb grows, limb. Okay, so embryo. Embryo flower two insects one two a fruit an eye and a limb What? Did it, did it want two eyes? Two eyes, embryo, flower, two insects, a fruit, eyes, one, two, 
maybe two claws. Okay. Little embryo. Flower. Two insects. A fruit. Two eyes. A limb. An embryo is forming. A flower blooms inside. Two insects crawling over. The fruit of life that grows. Now these eyes will open. Each limb grows one sharp blade. One sharp blade. How many limbs are growing though? Is it four limbs? When these all mix together, they're finally complete. How many limbs are growing? A strong smelling fruit. Human eye, a tiny insect. It just says, Embryo, a chicken egg, a common food ingredient. Is that is that considered an embryo? I mean, there's nothing else. It's already four o'clock. Jesus Christ, man. Oh, embryo. A flower. Two insects. A fruit. Eyes. Maybe four claws. Oh, I got it. I got it. I'm smart. Wait, did I read? Yeah, that's a pregnant chick. The book on the table reads, Three hearts have gathered, one hidden, one brave. They both feel desire, the third unaware. Beginning. It's a painting of three plants sprouting. There's a sculpture of a tree here. It's too heavy to move. Um. Three hearts have gathered. 
one hidden, one brave. They both feel desire. The third unaware. if I need to put them on this. See, because these two feel desire. She's hidden. He's brave. And the third heart is unaware. So my guess is that she's unaware for their desire. Oh, we actually have color. But where's the mom? There she is. Give us a pog chant. Lavender, what are you doing out here? I. I'm sorry. I dropped my new comb out the window. I I wanted to retrieve it before you'd get back. Is that so? Oh, Lavender. It's okay. I'm not mad. I'm sorry. Don't be. I was just surprised, that's all. We should just get back inside, okay? Okay. I brought lunch. Ah, thank you. Mama. Mia. The end. Hmm. I mean, a warning from the from the developer was you might not end up getting any horror out of it like you might be able to figure out the puzzles without it like what what like what rpg maker thank you for playing